Like I know that, and me and Alex have talked about this, and I've mentioned it on probably all of my videos recently. Like Sec Plus used to be that entry certification, <laughs> and you know where I'm going at with this. It used to be yep. the entry level certification, but now most places are wanting to see the CYSA for just getting into the doors and entry level, saying, "Hey, you understand basic cybersecurity analysis before we can even let you in the door to be a junior analyst." Which I'm, I, I have mixed feelings on that because I think honestly, just alone holding your Security Plus and showing the intent to learn, the willingness to grow, being reliable, being a good worker and showing up to work mm -hmm. on time, not calling out sick, showing up in office. I know a lot of folks are wanting the perfect remote job these days. Hybrid and full office is, and many organizations are coming full swing back back to office. I've seen a, I've seen a lot of positions too. So um, one thing I will say too in the job hunt, um, I've noticed that remote positions, uh, pay excluded pretty much, but I've noticed that a lot more of them have a ton of applicants to those versus uh, a lot more of the hybrid and other ones yep. they generally have less um you know linkedin one of the things that's great about it is obviously yes it interconnects us and allows us to see opportunities we may have missed but it also puts you in competition with a lot more people that like back in the day you probably didn't have to compete with because they had no way of seeing those jobs